go. Hey, what's up guys? This is Anthony with WB Varsity. Tonight we're going to be talking to senior running back Taylor Waddle and junior running back Jake Coppock of the Corbin Red Hounds. Uh, we're going to get to know these guys a little bit better, um, have a little fun, and uh, talk about their upcoming game against Wayne County. Uh, first off, uh, guys, tell me your favorite color. Let's go with red. Red for Taylor. Red for Jake. Excellent. What's your favorite food? Hmm. I'd say homemade fried chicken gravy and biscuits. Excellent choice. How about you, Jake? Good answer. Good answer. <laughs> there you go. Uh, what kind of music do you guys like to listen to? I like to listen to a lot of country. Country. That's about it. Country for Taylor. Country for Jake. Country for Jake. Uh, if you guys could have a dream job, anything in the world you could do, what would you do? Uh, probably physical therapist. Physical therapist, excellent. Playing the NFL. Playing the NFL, absolutely. <laughs> All right, guys. Um, at this point um, in your career, you guys have any plans set in stone for after high school? Uh, yeah, I'm wanting to go to a pre physical therapy school, uh, maybe at University of Cumberland, so I'm not sure yet. Awesome. And uh, after that, I'm wanting to do uh, physical therapy school at uh, probably either UK or U of L. Outstanding. Jake, you thought that far ahead yet? Not really. It's junior year for me. Junior year, absolutely. All right, so let's talk some football, guys. Um, who inspires you to play? To play the game on Friday nights. What gets you excited, and who would you say inspires you the most to play? Uh, probably have to say my dad and uh, all the Red Hound fans and all former players that have gone on before us. Yeah. Just seeing them out there in Spirit Line on Friday nights it gets gets me pumped up and ready to go. Big tradition there for the Corbin Red Hounds. Yeah. That's, a, that's awesome. Jake, anything you want to add to that? Yeah, I, I, sh I just like think about former players that's played here. Yeah. Like the great ones. And, Absolutely. You know, I get to play now. Yeah, a I huge know. tradition there, you know, and, uh, and you guys definitely, you know, carrying on that tradition extremely well um, down in Corbin. So uh, this year and last year, uh, you guys right now are 5-0. and uh, last year, losing season, uh, first one under Coach Jewell, unfortunately. What do you think is the biggest difference? Uh, I'd have to say the unity of the team and how close we are as a team. Yeah. And uh, you didn't see that a lot last year. Um, but we're just a tight-knit team and we like to all hang out with each other. And Fantastic. Good group of guys. Outstanding. Yeah, we grew up together, you know, we've been playing since we were five years old together. Yeah. One of us, you know. Yeah. I'm sure we're separate teams until middle school, but I mean, we, we know each other. We're, we're brothers. That's awesome. That's a great answer. Um, offensively this year, you guys have been put, putting up points, 213 points scored. Uh, defensively, you've only given up 21 points. Uh, what do you contribute to that success? Uh, I just run the ball. It's a lot of them that <laughs> does all that. They. Absolutely. If we didn't have them, we wouldn't be able to do our part. So. Absolutely. Shout out to the offensive line for Corbin. For sure. Yeah, absolutely. Jake, anything different? Those holes are huge. There you go. That's fantastic. All right, guys. 5-0. and You on a bye week. Getting ready to travel to Wayne County. Face the 5-0 Wayne County team. Huge game of the season for you. How sick are you of hearing about Wayne County? Uh, pretty tired of it. I wish we could just go out and play football already. And Absolutely. Get all this hop over with and just play. Absolutely. I don't blame you. Uh, it's going to be a fantastic game uh, Friday night. Uh, two undefeated teams. Uh, should be, should have all the buzz, you know, all the hype, uh, and it should live up to it. It's going to be a fantastic game Friday night. All right, so let's play a little word play. I'm going to throw a name out there, and first thing pops in your mind, for each of you. You can just uh, throw it out there right back at me. Johnny Manziel. Superstar. Superstar. Yeah, I'll go with that one. Absolutely. Very exciting. He's, he's crazy. Yeah. yeah, he is. Superstar, but he's got, I mean, yeah. he's a superstar. Yeah. Absolutely. Peyton Manning. The leader. Brilliant. Leader and brilliant. Two great answers there. UK football. A good slow one. right now <laughs> yeah absolutely a lot of hype you know coming into the season uh, you know folks are gonna have to learn I guess you know Rome wasn't built in a day 
So it's going to take yep. some time to uh, get that UK team competitive in the SEC. So yep. Stoops era. Yeah, exactly. Okay, uh, Coach Jewell. Uh, no comment on that one. No comment on that one. <laughs> Fantastic. Uh, rivalry. Bell County. Yeah, Bell. Bell County. Fantastic. Wayne County. W. W. Let's play. Let's play. Let's do it. Fantastic. That's, uh, like we said, guys, a huge game coming up for the Red Hounds as they travel to Wayne County uh, this Friday night. Uh, that's going to wrap it up for us. We want to thank Jake and Taylor for taking time out, stopping by Froyo's here in Corbin. Uh, we want to thank them, Froyo's that is, uh, for letting us sit up here on location. Uh, a couple sponsors to thank, CNS Grocery, Jamie Carr Repair and Remodel, and of course Venture Cabs. Uh, guys, be sure to like us on Facebook, follow us on Twitter, and uh, guys, thanks for your time. Uh, uh -huh. Good luck this Friday night. We definitely hope you stay healthy and uh, get that W against Wayne County. Thank you. That's all guys, thanks for watching.